Uh, I was in kindergarten. I just started school, moved to a new town. I didn't know anybody. Um, I was out in the playground, and uh, I didn't have any friends. I didn't know anyone. I was trying to just make my way into a friend circle, or into a circle, get to know some of the kids. And uh, some of the kids started calling me a name. And thank you. Yeah, they started calling me a name, and I had no idea what it meant. And I'm pretty sure you can, you can guess what that name was. It was uh, not an appropriate name for anybody to say, uh, especially not to a five-year-old boy. So yeah, um, they started calling me that name, pushing me around the playground, uh, and I had to go, obviously, to a teacher who brought me then to a principal, um, and we had to have a meeting, a conference. They called the boys' parents in, they called my parents in, we all sat down, we all talked about what happened. Um, I had no idea what the word meant. So that was my first experience with, with racism. My parents had to take me home, talk to me about it, tell me what the word meant, um, and then proceed to give me a speech that I think a lot of, a lot of black people or mixed race people have had. Um, that just, I'm not gonna go too much into it, but it just kind of tells you that um, you are different, you're always gonna be seen as different, and no matter, no matter what you do or how you act, it's, it's gonna be the way you're perceived first and foremost. That's a really hard thing. It's a really hard thing for a kid to swallow. Um, I, I kind of, I 